experienced by ADS, and he attained them with the help of an ADS employee called Jasper pra Prado. Potter doesn't know this person's full name. Seems like Potter, a big name in the local arms trafficking business, worked in close cooperation with Big, an esteemed arms contractor, <laughs> Bart Fair. Now that's what Bart Fair wrote. Fuck you, mannequin. Don't move. Yeah, I definitely heard gunshots. Well, I, I heard loud bangs. I guess they were gunshots, because the guy was shot, right? <laughs> anyway, that guy I, sounds I so stupid. Cujo, my dog. I guess they were gunshots. My wife's a heavy sleeper, and Cujo's always needing the shit in the morning, so yeah, sometimes <laughs> I take him out for a walk. So yeah, I, I was walking down Palm Power Lane and into the fields when the shots were fired. Okay. Right, so that's one thing. Why is there a mannequin, though? What does the mannequin represent? I have not got a clue. Oh! That's so weird. It creates the memory. Oh. The scene. I don't know. That is weird, though. All I can hear is... Him just... Hurry! Is there something here? No. Hurry. Yeah, all I can hear is him just shouting out, hurry. Interesting. I want to find out more, though. Is there anything over here? Hurry. There's a body. No, there isn't. I'm just seeing things. I don't think we actually have to hurry. Ah, here we go. The fuck? Another mannequin. Case opening. <laughs> Appli reopening application. They spelled application wrong. Really? Oh my god. They spelled it there. Correctly. Oh my god. Application is two P's. Due to new evidence linking Jasper Prado's death to the Bronze Grove kidnapping, Prado's DNA was found near the blast site. I hereby request reopening both cases since they appear to be linked. Wow, it's, it was d dismissed. Damn. That's rough. Is that another picture? Oh, it is, but it's not one that takes me into a thing. That's Prado's car. Evidence in case something. That's another case thing. Personal data. Just for Prado. British, 39. Six foot two. Wow. Arrest record. Sensitive information removed. Traffic driving 15 miles per hour over the limit. Forci forcible entry and detainer. Classy drug possession. Can oh, no. The eyes of Pam. Nitro... Uh, I don't know how you say that word. Nitrosopam? Cannabis and... Cathine. Traffic driving 20 miles an hour above the limit. And Class B drugs. Cannabis codeine. Okay. There wasn't any, um... Tape regard this time, though. Still don't like all the mannequins. Why are they made out of wood, too? They're I would say they're less creepy, but to be honest, they're still creepy. Mannequins are just creepy. It's just kind of something that is. I don't think there'll be anything here. I mean, you never know. It's just a crumpled box. You got to help me, hurry. Hurry, you can stop this. I don't actually know where I need to go, though. Yeah, I can hear you. Loud and clear. Oh, another memory. Shite, is that where I need to be? Perhaps. It could be. I don't know if I want to be here, though. Oh. Police department. Homicide case file. Case opened the si oh, 20th of June, 2015. Detective Bart Fair missing. Oh, dear. 45-year-old Detective Bart Fair has been reported missing following a four-day period where he failed to report to, for work and his wife. Jenny Fair was unable to contact him. The, chronic, the Chronicle was able to contact Fair's workmate, Hector Chadwick, who has taken unpaid leave in order to help find his friend. He's a great copper, Bart, but he always got too far involved with his work. A man should never put his career first, especially when he has a family. I'll find him. He'll be fine. Detective Fair was the recipient of the Severn Police Bravery Award in 2009. Following his famous rugby tackle of a knife-wielding maniac at Birmingham Moore Street Station. Oh. That is pretty heroic. 
Alright, so there was that. I think I just have to investigate the entire area. And it'll lead to stuff. Whoa. I'm hearing like bashing on stuff now. Now I'm wanting to find more of the memories. Maybe the ones... I think the things that are dotted are memories. They are... Whatever's like a dotted line in, on the map. Oh, it's a, it's a phone box. Patricia Bateman. Recall night. Sexy girls. Wait, what's that? Sexy girls and big guns. Huh. Is that a book or a film? Probably a film. Oh, whoops. What's your problem? I won't tell you where I am. You need to back the fuck away now. This is out of your hands and there's nothing you can do about it. So leave me the fuck alone and just let this run its course. I like that he's Irish. Leave me the fuck alone. Let this run its course. Alright. Hello, Mr. Copper. Oh, God. You just like... They just fragment. So there's another. Yeah, it is. It's literally anywhere that's got a dotted line around it. I didn't realise that before. Now I do. That noise is getting louder. <laughs> think we got it. I think I've got everything so far. Oh great, let's go into a small space. Great. Huh? Oh. What's the point? Why create a door? Surprised no door was created. Can't go through there. He's just creating things. Whoa. Black, I've been reviewing the data. Though you've been thorough in gathering evidence, your pursuit of supposition has sadly rendered this investigation useless. I'm pulling you out. No, Red, not yet. I'm so close. Oh. I guess he isn't pulling me out then. Okay. He's getting so loud. That is just constant banging now. Oh god. Straight ahead. Oh. Oh god. Oh dear. Oh god, there's more. Ouch. Shite. Reload! What the fuck? Why are there so many? Why am I using a terrible, terrible gun? Jesus Christ! I guess I couldn't have made it. You pulled me out. Like I said, you began making assumptions. The Pandora is neutral, Black, and so must you be. Maybe you really were there to save Jasper. But the moment you assume that to be true, you corrupt the simulation and cast doubt over the memory. If you continue to do so, we will not be able to proceed. Maybe I don't want to proceed. Oh, I think you do, Mr. Black. You wouldn't be here if you didn't want answers. <sighs> hmm. Oh, he was corrupting it with grace. As opposed to Jasper. I think that's what it was. Oh... Hmm. Well. Now what's happened? Are we back in the hospital? Most probably. Yep. Let's try a different approach this time, Black. Different how? I'd like to try starting... Before Prado was killed. You want me to try again? To save Jasper? I don't want you to try anything, Mr. Black. Everything is prepared for you. Just relax and explore. Yeah, sure. Oh, I just realized this was here. Body found in a warehouse. The body of a 40-year-old man was found in a man in a warehouse. Uh, okay, I've already got that, I think. Close range. Yep. Okay. Oh, right. We go through here now. Ta-da. Nope. Nope. Only one way to go. Oh, wow. Different. Wait, that opens. Oh dear, why did that open? Oh, that takes me to the new place if I want to. 
Yeah. I don't think I do. A new text. Oh, new entry. The police hit a dead end, but I knew the victim. Hmm. Okay. I don't know if there's any hostiles. It doesn't look as if there are. Can't interact with that. Oh, here we go. That door shut behind me. Good. Right, we have more evidence stuff. Sugar email. I talked to Ben and Eric and I thought I made it perfectly clear. The bad apple needs to be removed as soon as possible. We can't take the risk. Okay. Like I said on the phone, this is delicate. You work for me and you follow my orders. If you can't handle that, I'll find someone else. No mucking about. Huh. Interesting. What is this? What the hell? You read it? Yep, what do you think? Ain't happy the guy's a snitch, yeah? But I'm not sure about putting him in the ground. If we don't, boss is gonna fucking kill us and his missus is gonna dance on our graves. I know. Come on, we do this together, mate. Get rid of the problem and forget it. Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, just get rid of the problem. Kill him, execute, whatever. Vicious crime in the warehouse. Isn't this one we've already had? Cops have managed to say he was found in an abandoned warehouse this week. And yet nobody has the slightest clue regarding the victim's true identity. Detective Chief Inspector Edwin Hughes had this to say. It appears that the victim was shot at close distance, yet, but we've yet to establish how long the body was there prior to its discovery. The autopsy is scheduled for Friday. No specific details about the victim's identity have been released, been released yet. But a source close to the investigation cl and claims this was a drug-related crime. I claim that's bullshit. Victim or culprit? First it was a corp- it was the corpse, a dead body found in the warehouse near Route 10. Then we learned the victim's name was Jasper Prado. Now for the first time we investigate who he really was. An innocent man who was a, vic who was a victim of a psychopath or a cold-hearted criminal who got what was coming to him. Since being discharged from the military over a decade ago, Prado returned to the country where he immediately began contributing to what would become a substantial criminal record. Just four months before his death, he was arrested for drug possession. Was his death drug-related, or did his lifestyle become too much to handle? The police have yet to officially rule out suicide. He was shot. He wasn't... He didn't Listen, off himself. Me. You need to tell me where the fuck you are and what the fuck is going on. You've got a lot to answer for, you know that. Call me back the second you get this, or there'll be consequences. That's weird. Hearing a recording of his of himself. The place is known as the Shell. It's an abandoned warehouse about half a mile from the gas station on Route 10. It's not a Shell station and probably never was. One local myth suggests it gets its name from the numerous shell casings found in the warehouse over the years. The place certainly looks like it witnessed its fair, fair share of killing. Huh. We have this. Oh, that's that's Jasper. His record. He was 19. Oh my god. Well, they made it seem like he was in the... He was in a lot of... He was in the army for a while, but I guess not. Letter of Appreciation. Dear Lieutenant Prado, it is my pleasure and privilege, privilege to express my appreciation for your contribution to the su success of Operation Grapple. You and the other members of your division did an outstanding job to securing, of securing a forward position, setting up and establishing communications, and coordinating the movement of follow-on forces. Without your dedication to, to duty, Operation Grapple would not have been the success that it was. Congratulations on a job well done. Colonel William King. And there's the photo. Whoosh! Awesome! What did I do wrong last time? You just lost your way, Black, that's all. My reading suggests the majority of that memory remains unexplored. Focus this time. Assume nothing. Explore the memory in full. <laughs> Relax and explore. Very good, Mr. Black. Relax and explore. Hmm. That seems to be their motto. And into the memory we go. Kabloom. When it decides to load, you know. Right, come on. <gasps> Here we are. I have the corner gun. Remember, this is exactly the same memory as the last one, just a little earlier on. Oh. We need a clearer understanding of exactly what happened. Understood. This memory is a little temperamental, Mr. Black. I would advise against going in guns blazing. But try not to get spotted. Right. Oh, hang on. 
Wait, what's that? I may be going insane too. I passed out and had... I don't know what that is. And had the something drawn? Oh, and had the weirdest dream, I think is what it says. Right, scan, scan, scanner! It's blood! DNA found. One matching profile. Jasper Prado. Oh dear. I say we just leave him. No, mate. What's his orders? We'll bring him in. Fuck you! Hmm. Actually, if I just walk up to this, it should scan it. Boom! Okay. I need the map, if anything. Don't take his off. Hostiles. I can't do that. Crap. Yeah, I don't really want to deal with that. There's a lot of them, though. God damn. Oh yeah, I can just- I saw them. God, they are obvious. I don't get it. What did Jasper do exactly? Took matters into his own hands is what I heard. Yeah, but what happened? I don't know. Order came from the top. Bring him in at all costs. What about Jared then? Try to stop it, idiot. Too green. Too green. He'll learn. If he ever gets out. Is that it? I guess so. Hmm. Oh. There's also this. Oh, it's a picture of them. Jasper, Wesley, Tafik and Ale. Huh. I think the other guy's just looking around. Yeah. There's not a way out of here. It's just a bit of a pain. I'll get spotted if I try and go that way. That's the thing. Shoot. Thing is, I don't really want to kill them, but I don't know if I have a choice. Yeah, I don't think I have a choice. I'll try and get one of them from over here. That's weird looking. Yeah, do that. I just don't know how bad it will be. Hopefully I can get rid of him. It's a silenced gun, so... Oh. What's that? Oh, I was about to say, what the hell is that guy doing? He'll never know. Which, hopefully, will mean he won't... Um see me go under that. I don't think he will, because he's facing a different place. Just have to hope. But it's really hard to tell. Hmm. All I can think is... moving through the shrubbery. I just want to shoot him just so he's not going to be a problem, but I also don't. Hmm. Just do it. Filthy, Mr. Black. Very good. Of course I'd be stealthy, why wouldn't I? I don't want to kill everybody though. Because they said it affects 
Who are you saying? Wheels are in motion from Jasper. Didn't want to do that. What I want to do is go on my map. For Christ's sake. There it is. Oh. She's just a girl. You've been around, but you know the score. Yeah. Maybe I'm getting old. Speak for yourself, Bob. Oh. A gun. I'll just go this way. Then hope he doesn't turn towards me. I guess. Oh, wow. Oh god. Oi, someone back there. No. Oh god. Uh. Uh. I I was gonna say I guess they know. Yeah they do. Oh no. Wait, there's a thing here. Apparently. Jesus. Being completely stealthy is really hard. It's just I was trying to get around one of them. Didn't really work. Yeah, okay, I'm probably really obvious. Fuck. Oh wait, we're only a guy's in the warehouse, right? Yeah, probably. Oh, yeah, I've been detected all the like. I get detected all the time. It sucks. Is this it? Well, it's somewhere. Can I close behind me? Oh, that works. Oh, there's am uh, ammo. Something I can detect. Mr. Black, I think that something is wrong with this memory again. It's becoming highly unstable. I will try to fix it. In the meantime, I'm sending you a picture. One I need you to use it to Jasper exit. Prado. Wait, you're sending me a picture? Oh, there. Do I have to? I guess so. Okay. Weird. Oh, where the hell am I? I'm in that filing cabinet again, aren't I? But what are these? Weapons, Mr. Black. A personal armory, if you will. I thought you said I shouldn't kill. Something about distorting memories. The more evidence you uncover, the less we risk distortion. You're saying that I need to collect all the evidence for each board? That's up to you, Mr. Black. But if you do, the memories become more stable, which means I can reward you with a new toy every now and then. Hmm. Fair enough. Congratulations, Mr. Black. Whoa. You've collected all the available memory. We may find a way to use the code you've discovered. Could be significant. So the man from the Lithurst Asylum. The kidnapping. The victim. And then Jasper's dying minutes. Hmm. Am I supposed to just use this to get back? Go! seems to have stabilized. Proceed. Okay. Oh god, there's a guy right here. So now I know that I can kill. This is weird.
Oh god. It goes up there. No, there's one over there. Ugh. I've just realised as well, I'm using the... Not the wrong gun, but I wasn't using a silenced one. Which could have been problematic. Ah. God damn, it would help if I could aim. Oh my god, I can't. Shh. Oh god. Thing is, there's no body for them to uncover, which is very useful. Hmm. I don't like the noise it makes when you kill, though. It makes it sound like killing's a bad idea. Or killing was the wrong thing. There he is. Do -do -do. Okay. What I'm hoping for is to be able to get upstairs. Hey! There we go. Perfect. Well, maybe. You can still see me if I'm up above. To be fair, it might be even easier to spot if I'm up above. Maybe not. Not something I really want to judge. I'll find out, you know. Oh god, there's a guy over there. Sod it. Oh! Oh god. Oh god. I was spotted. I don't know how, but I was spotted. How was I... How was I spotted, though? I didn't get spotted. I just killed somebody. Shit, he's back, he's back. Oh god. Oh shit, where am I going? Bloody hell. My god. Oh yay, give me this. Bloody hellfire. It's like, I'm, I'm so conflicted with what the hell to do. Like, do I shoot them? Do I not? Do I shoot them? Do I not? So I can choose, I choose to shoot them and then I end up just getting pen penalised. Ouch. I really should just use the corner gun. As an actual corner gun, but whatever. Got him. But never mind. Oh god, they do know where I am. I was wondering. Boom! Create something. Hell yeah, more cover. Okay, hopefully I can get through this without everybody wanting to kill me, still. They probably all want to kill me, though. Crap, that's not good. Uh, that created something. I have more cover. All right. Let's just wait him out, boys. How am I? God fucking damn! Wait, what? Jesus Christ! I guess they can see me. Shit. I've got him, guys. This way. Oh my god, I'm just gonna have to keep killing, aren't I? Fucking fuck off. <laughs> do, 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 do. It says, like, if I kill, it affects how others perceive me, which is not what I'm wanting. I can't really help it. 
Not particularly. Wait, isn't there something here? Oh god. Okay, no. Well, that's a different- oh, we're in a different room. Oops. Got him! Yeah, I didn't realise it's actually connected. Now I know it is. Oh. What the hell even- what gun are they even using? Like you're in a damn video game. No. The simulation may corrupt, destroying both, both itself and you in the process. Now, continue. I love that. It must be up, a, up above or something. I don't know, it's, it's confusing. Stop acting like you're in a damn video game. Well, it's not like I'm not. God damn it, I don't want to kill them all, but I might have to. It's fucking shitty. I'm trying to find more of the uh, anomalies. Well, it's like I got told I could basically kill without consequence, and now I can't kill without consequence. It's like, what the fuck? Make your mind up. I also really don't know where the fuck I'm going. Oh wait, maybe I go up here. No, this just leads to where I've already been. Goddamn. And also tires me out, which is not good. Yeah, I've probably killed literally everybody in this. That's because I haven't. Stop acting like you're in a damn video game by doing the same. Now I don't have to worry and I can just focus on searching. I probably missed a Oh, I could have gone left. Instead I went back when I should have gone this way. That's where I messed up. I'm curious if, like, killing does actually cause any sort of issues with the game. Like, the only thing it seems to or the game said was that, um, killing affects how others perceive you. Which I don't know if is 100% true. Somebody sounds in pain. Hey! Hear me out! Please! Just, just hear me out. What do you want? You're here for Jasper, yeah? They've got him back there. And why are you here? They locked me up because I was helping him out, but I only did it out of fear, I swear. 